In this video, I am going to share everything you need to know about how to grow garlic in pots. In most places, you can plant garlic anytime from September until December. It can take anywhere from 6 to 8 months after planting for harvesting. Subscribe and press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update from Urban Gardening. To get it started, all you need to do is buy fresh garlic bulbs with large cloves. You can head start garlic cloves by keeping them in water. Fill each container with water. It's best to start the garlic sprouts in a transparent glass or bottle so that you can watch as the bulbs puts out roots and begins to grow. Orient the garlic bulbs so that the sprouting end of the cloves points upward. The flat end of the bulb should face downwards. Place them in full sun and ensure that the location you choose gets 5 to 7 hours of direct sunlight per day. After 2 days, your garlic should begin to sprout and after 5 to 6 days, you can separate them out and plant them in the soil. Now separate out cloves, be careful not to damage the cloves at their base. If the base gets damaged, the garlic will not grow. Save the biggest cloves for planting and use the smallest one in the kitchen. Your selected container should be at least 8 to 15 inches deep to allow ample room for the roots to grow. My garlic planting pot is 22 inches in diameter and I will plant 10 to 12 cloves. The larger the container, the more cloves you can plant and the less frequently you have to water. Your selected container needs to have some drainage holes at the bottom. Garlic needs a well-drained soil mix or the cloves may rot. I recommend a mix that contains 50% garden soil. 30% compost and 20% river sand. Mix well before use. Now make 2 to 3 inches deep holes in the soil mix and plant one clove per hole. Plant the garlic 2 inches in from the rim of the container, spacing the cloves 4 to 6 inches apart in all directions. Sink each clove into the soil, pointy end up so the base of the clove sits about 2 to 3 inches beneath the soil surface. In the process, make sure that the green tip of the clove remains above the soil surface. Water the soil lightly and be sure to keep monitoring it throughout the winter. Make sure the soil stays moist but not soggy. Garlic likes bright direct sunlight and it will need at least 5 to 6 hours of it a day in order to grow properly. You can also plant them in the traditional way. Break apart a large head of garlic and plant only the biggest cloves. The bigger the clove, the greater the chance it will produce a nice big head of garlic. Hold each clove pointed end up and push it into the soil about 2 inches deep making sure that the tip of the clove remains above the soil surface. Each clove will sprout into a garlic plant, so keep that in mind when you are figuring out how many heads or bulbs to buy. Plant cloves in their upright position, wide root side facing down and pointed end facing up. Space your cloves about 4 to 6 inches apart, do not cram them together, to form large heads, the cloves need plenty of room. Once the cloves have been planted, water the pot well.
position the container somewhere that get at least 6 hours of direct sunlight per day. Ideally, garlic plants should be watered to the full depths of their root and soil should stay evenly moist but not wet, especially during the first few months in the ground after cloves begin to grow. You can also start picking out the greens when they are 5 to 7 inches tall but remember to leave an inch of growth on each clove to let your garlic plants grow again. For healthy growth keep the soil evenly moist but not wet. Fertilize your garlic plants by spreading a general purpose fertilizer evenly throughout the soil no more than twice a month. If your potting mix is nutritious enough, your garlic may not need fertilizer. However, using a fertilizer can make your garlic grow faster and lead to a better harvest. Now work it into the first few inches of the soil with a gardening tool. After every 20 to 25 days, dig upper layer of the soil to keep it soft. This will help the bulbs to grow bigger. As the garlic plants mature, the lower leaves will turn brown and dry up. Water your garlic during dry periods throughout the growing season but stop watering completely during the last few weeks. The garlic needs a hot dry summer to allow the bulbs to mature. Your garlic will be ready to harvest in midsummer. A promising sign that your garlic is ready to be collected is when the leaves begin turning yellow. To harvest your garlic, be sure to dig into the soil. Dig from the sides to pull the bulb out. Avoid damaging the roots, especially the root plate. Lift the plants, carefully brush off surplus soil but do not remove any foliage or roots before putting them to dry thoroughly.
Once the garlic is out of the pot, shake off any loose dirt, hang or set aside your garlic bulbs to dry for at least 8 to 15 days. This is Kashmiri garlic, also known in India as Himalayan or Jammu garlic, is a rare single clove variety of Allium sativum. Research has shown Kashmiri garlic to be 7 times more potent than commercial garlic in terms of beneficial compounds and properties. You will know it's completely dried out when the garlic bulbs begin to flake. At this stage you can separate the stem and roots from the bulbs and store them in a cool dry place.